Welcome back to some more Car Mechanic Simulator 2015 and today my friends it is time to do the other Mercedes. This one we're gonna do a little bit differently though for the reason that it was a rust bucket piece of wank and it still is. As you can tell this thing is not in good condition whatsoever. Look at the state of this absolute horrendous piece of piece of shit basically it's a piece of shit if you look under the the hood open the other way <laughs> if you look under the hood you can see that this thing is just not happy at all in any way like it's it's not happy look at it it's disgusting so what i thought we'd do is instead of fixing this thing completely because the interior is pretty nice we'll make ourselves a rat rod almost not a rat rod completely because it's not really the same thing but you're basically a rust bucket that is just fully sorted out inside wise but on the outside it looks like a piece of shit and that's a cool way to do it with this video just make it a little bit different spice it up a little bit so what we're gonna do is move this bad boy over to one of those over there that one over there and we need to actually go through my interior interior inventory and uh, sell basically everything here because I don't oh, that was great. That was that was more really useful sell everything here because I don't Need it. How much stuff do I have? Bloody Nora. It's going on for days Jesus Christ, how much do I have? I now this much to what that thing in the bottom right is gonna be popping up constantly But what we need to do now is go in here and fix this bloody engine This thing is not looking happy at all So we're gonna do is take out literally everything here and attempt to repair it and if we can't repair it Well, we'll try it but uh <laughs> the, the, In that case what we'll need to do is well buy the new parts obviously now I'm wondering are there any performance parts that are available for this car? I know obviously it's just a, a general thing on this game in where if it's uh if, if a part fits the L6 engine or straight six engine should I say it's going to to fit all of them so I'm hoping that's the case I'm not exactly 100% sure on that but yeah that's that's hopefully what we've got here you see I'd never buy anything like this because I wouldn't trust myself in like fixing it at all in the slightest like it's literally completely dead I don't think anyone should ever buy a car like this whatsoever even if you're gonna make like oh I'm gonna make it rusty on the exterior and perfect on the inside mate your car's just gonna collapse on you if you if, you're, if I'm honest with you it's just it's just ridiculous there's there's having like a rat rod and then there's having this bloody thing that just literally is it's not it's not worth anything i can't remember how much i spent on it but hopefully i didn't spend a lot because this is fucking this is stupid we actually looked at all the parts didn't we look at the uh, condition of all of them every single thing is just shite there's no there's no one good part on this car and i bought it i could have gone for something a little bit easier on myself but no i like to have a challenge apparently because all that oh I'm, I'm an absolute idiot Probably a combination of both. Can we take that out? Yes, we can. Now, what do we need to do to take this off? Yes! Finally, we're getting somewhere. Oh, God, this is going to be such a fucking... It is a piece of shit, all right? We're fixing a piece of shit here. I don't care if we're going to oil clean up, mate. It's bloody pennies. I'll, I'll fix it. It's all right. It's fuck the environment. This bloody suspension is getting in the way of the engine. Get out. I don't need you. <laughs> You're bloody useless to me at the moment. Anyway, how do I get to you? There we go. I would be a fiddly or bastard to get out on this. While we're under here, yeah. what we're going to do is take off the wheels and the suspension. We may as well, rather than uh, moving it up and down about 50 billion times. So come off the brakes, come off the brakes. Now, this actually reminded me of the fact that I've got to do my Lexus's MOT um, like next week. Like next week, otherwise the, uh, it's not road legal anymore. <laughs> I completely forgot, which I, no, I've just been putting it off if I'm quite honest with you. Just, I've been moving and it's just, you know, it's a little bit annoying that I have to do my amateur at the time of bloody moving. I don't, I picked the perfect timing for absolutely everything, as you clearly fucking know. But, hey, it's just, it's just the way it is sometimes. You gotta, you gotta do it, Theo. And people are like, what's an MOT? People are asking me. Well, friends, in the UK, we, are, we have very strict rules on what's drivable and what isn't. <laughs> like, I, I was in America and there's a guy that lit his the whole back end was smashed in. The whole back end of his car was like smashed in. He'd been in a crash. His rear light wasn't visible, it was crumbled in. And uh, he was still driving it and nobody like batted an eye except all the UK people. Like, what the fuck? What, 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 what? But yeah, and I was in uh, in parts of Europe, for example, and they drive a cracked window screen. If you drove here with a cracked window screen, you would be shot in the face. No, you wouldn't because we're not allowed guns. It's just like UK is just kind of like that. That's probably the best way to explain it. You would have got shot. No, you wouldn't because we wouldn't shoot people here. <laughs> but yeah, it's absolutely ridiculous the, the amount of stuff we go through. And uh, we, we have to like, obviously you have to service your cars. But the thing of it is like a, a test to make sure that your car is being looked after as road legal. 
that's, that's pretty much it. And uh, usually they'll find something to couch you out on and you'll be like, well, you're the one that fucking agreed that you'd help me change that and you knobs. Well, whatever. There isn't a hell of a lot that could be wrong with my car. Um, but there's going to be little things that they'll pick up on that I just didn't know about. It's like, they'll probably be like, oh yeah, your car's, I wouldn't, I wouldn't drive that if I were you. I'd be like, but when you were servicing it, you said it was perfect. Yeah, well, this is a little bit different. Fuck you. Almost like we might have to prat about with it anyway. This is bloody stupid, mate. Why are, you, why are you doing this to me, game? And I, I know, I know it. Cream interior, though. Highly recommended it. I, I don't. It's, it's a terrible idea. Oh, bloody left wire is... Fucking pizza shit. There we go. That's pretty much everything. It's now just removing the fuel pump and then the fuel tank. And then it's literally just this front part here, which we need to bring it down to get to. And then it's done. I think we're pretty much done after that point. Take out the engine block. It is gone. The car is now a shell. That's its name, a shell. Going through all this is gonna be so much fun. You have no idea. I'm gonna, I'm gonna love this. Now, I'm gonna repair a lot of it. I'm gonna attempt to repair a lot of it. And I just wanted to very quickly check that if we go into a few, I try and think of a, a thing that we can change in here that we can maybe swap out a uh, performance part for. Maybe we can do that. I'm not exactly sure, but we're gonna have a look. So we've got a middle muffler here, and I'm assuming that's a part we can put on because it just is literally called the exact same name. There are parts of the exhaust that have like specific names. You can see Sebring, and I doubt those parts will actually be available to throw in, but can we actually put the middle part in without putting the other part in? So we've got rear muffler, Sebring, um, middle muffler. Can we put that in? Yes! There we go. So we can put in some performance things. There's just very little of them, but this will be this will be quite interesting if we can get some in here. What I'll do is I'll go to the repair table and we will repair everything here that we can, hopefully. So we repair and press escape. We're going to break a lot of stuff if we can actually get the flow a bit. There we go. We're going to break a lot of stuff, but that's just the way it is. I keep I, I always mess this up. Going through the list, you can see that it was very hit and miss with a lot of the things, which is a little bit shit, but that's just the way it is. Right, um, right, 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 right. What do we start with? We'll start with the suspension because we know that is uh, a lot of stuff. Well, we can't replace any of the suspension with the performance stuff, so we'll throw that in. Perfectly fitted. Beautiful. I love it. That's fixed absolutely perfectly. I'm happy. I'm happy. You can tell that I fixed that. You can see it just lo looks beautiful. We need brake disc ventilated, so that needs sorting, and we also need wheel hubcaps. How the fuck do we break those? And also the brake pads as well. Somehow, we're just bloody crap at everything. I bet you these are broke as well. No, those are actually fine. Those are fine. That's 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 perfectly fine with me. Now, if we can put the wheel on, that would be great. Oh, we can't put the wheel on until we put the axles and such on and the rest of the suspension arms. There we go. That's beautiful. Oh my god, we literally freaking corroded it completely in that case, but... We can actually do this side here because I know we have the parts for it. We'll have every part for this one because I bought two extras of everything we need. And if we don't, if we didn't have everything we need, I would be slightly annoyed. Hopefully, this one was oh, it was 100%. Otherwise, I would cry. We're gonna need four rubber bushings in this whole process apparently. So let's actually buy four of those now. I'll thank myself later for that. So uh, let's buy a load of <laughs> load of <laughs> a load of extra just in case because you know these bastards they they just pop up and they're like you know what. I need another one. Thankfully, the rims on this car are actually done perfect. Look at it. You can see your face in it, except you don't have a face on this game, so you, 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 can't, you can't. Oh my god, it's got little caps as well. I love it. I was going to say it looks a little bit different than the actual one on here, but yeah, that is, that is awesome. I love these rims. I would put these on like any car ever, except, well, the, the rims are a bit small. They should be bigger. Like, Obviously, the tires used to take up so much more space because they were just like, oh, oh, careful, care careful. Annoyingly, like, one of these was working. A lot of this, like, a lot with the suspension side here, one of the things got fixed and the others didn't. Can I put the bushings in first? That would be great. So, we need a leaf spring, which looks like the most unreliable thing I've ever seen in my bloody life. But we got to put some on. So, hopefully, actually, the bits underneath. All right, I bought two. I don't know why. I just I buy too many things. I don't need to worry about it. I'm rich on this game. I can I can buy what I want. I'm PewDiePie. Uh no, don't don't quite want that to be in there. So let's uh what is it? It's a, a drive axle. Let's just put drive axle. Okay, and the brake shoe and the drum brake and the drum brake was another thing that was broken, which is why I bought two of those. But that is pretty much the, most of the suspension done on the back. It's now literally obviously the shock absorbers. And we're basically done here, I would say. Oh, we need to also put 
on the bottom parts of here. Thankfully, those aren't broken. Thankfully, we actually managed to fix a solid piece of metal. If we couldn't fix a solid piece of metal that's just like this, I would be slightly disappointed. Like... How shit of a mechanic would I be? <laughs> now, you see, when we were trying to repair your car, we accidentally destroyed a solid piece of fucking metal, and I just saw that we have destroyed one. Once the game actually lets me tie that up, you'll see when I put... That's, fuck, that's just embarrassing. Now, you can see here there's a lot of specific parts for this car, which come up a little bit easier if you just search the name. So, well, that's what I did, and I'm just going to buy that straight out. And I know for a fact that there's another part of the exhaust that just did not... It's not happy, so let's throw that in. And I'm hoping... It's annoying that we can't get, like, a proper performance one. I did check, don't worry. But if we go over to here, you can see that this middle muffle part is definitely a performance one because it's extra shiny. Now, if we go over here, you can see, again, it's another specific part for the car. And annoyingly, it's broken! I'll very quickly put another one in because I have the menu up already. Now, I think that is pretty much all of the undercarriage that's required, isn't it? Except, obviously, the, the axle, which we can't get to yet because we don't have anything in there. Which, well, in the front. I should open it in the front. Bring it down. What? Oh, I'm still underneath it. Sorry for standing underneath it. Okay, we have actually got a full fuel filter that we can throw in. Um, we'll put that one in there. That looks a little bit different, don't you think? Ignition coil B. Let's throw that in there. And ignition coil B again. Now, what is next? Battery. We didn't we didn't fix the battery. Just charge it, your knob. We've got a performance alternator in there. So that's one extra thing to throw in a little bit more power. I'm quite happy with how this is turning out. There's a couple of things we can throw in that give it a bit more performance. The radiator definitely needs fucking replacing. So I'm an absolute idiot. And I thought that this was actually a straight six. It's actually a straight four. I'm, I'm an absolute idiot. But uh, we've got ourselves... It's not, it's not going to have power steering, is it? No, it's, it's not. Uh, so we haven't got anything in here performance-wise. Performance part-wise, part we can throw in, if I'm quite honest with you. A lot of it looks as if... Well, it's not going to work. Maybe this, the manifold. I don't know. Look at that brand spanking new drive shaft in there as well. I think one, we had like two performance parts so far. Well, the clutch as well. We've got a performance clutch and part of my exhaust is a performance exhaust. And that's about it, which is, this is pretty shit actually. Now, I bought a few pistons as well, the performance pistons. Mine didn't actually, they actually got worse <laughs> when we tried to repair them. Uh, but that's fine, that's just the way it is sometimes. So I bought a few pistons to throw into it. If I can actually get the right angle, that'd be freaking fantastic, thank you. And I, it looks like I've actually bought the perfect amount. I actually spammed it <laughs> and hope for the best. That's basically what I do on this game, I spam and hope for the best. Throw on that bad boy, we've got the camshaft. I think we'll have cams, surely we'll have cams. Unfortunately we don't, we only have normal ones. Oh balls, I just put that shit one in, get out. Wait, that's what's thrown me off. So it has a straight six cam... I'm really confused here. <laughs> this car's really thrown me off. It's having straight, a straight six with a straight... This is fucking me up. This is, this is messing me up a little bit. A straight four gearbox in a straight six. Why? I knew it was a straight... What's going on? What's going on with me? I don't understand. This is really throwing me... This is throwing me off. It's, it says a manifold of a straight six as well. What's going on? Well, that's another performance part we can throw. Ah, da, 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 da. That's another performance part we can throw on. I bought two instead of the correct amount, so I'll fix that in a second. But that's another performance part we can throw. This thing is throwing, throwing me off. You guys in the comments are probably going to be like, Theo, you're a knob. You're a piece of shit. Earlier, you, you said fucking straight this. Uh, it's different. It's wrong. You, you're wrong. You're a tit. All right. We've got the performance carburetors as well. So we'll put those in there. There you go. Carburetor. Carbur Those are really weird looking things, aren't they? I don't even... It's kind of like an alien. It's a big spaceship. That's what it is. It's a spaceship. Oh, my camera's telling me that the uh, the temperature is quite hot. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> That's not good. I didn't test the, the long-term recording of, of this camera in ridiculous heat because I don't have good like weather at the moment it's, it's too hot uk people like cam camshaft cap let's let's see can we get performance camshaft caps let's have a look go on cam do it no we don't uh i may have bought about 50 million but that's fine let's throw all these bad boys oh we gotta bolt them all in and obviously i didn't buy a fucking enough did i so let's buy more of them come on the camshaft cap man is gonna be happy do you think there's like a dealer that specifically sells camshaft caps so hi, what do you sell? You uh, you say you sell autoports, camshaft caps, just 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 cam camshaft caps, yeah. You manufacture and sell camshaft caps. Do you not do anything camshaft camshaft 
camshaft caps. And for the spark plugs, we didn't repair any of them, but that doesn't matter. Do you know why? Because it gives us a reason to buy some performance ones. So let's buy spark. Yes, we buy a lot of them. Probably got more than enough, but I don't care. No! I'm going to take a spark plug and shove it up your ass. That's what I'm going to do. Be careful. Don't you mess with me. I'm... I don't, I don't, I'm kind of getting a little bit loopy here. It's not just the camera that's hot. It's me as well. Help me. Please. And the cover goes on beautifully there. Mm, Maserati. Don't mind if I do. Very nice. Uh, <laughs> let's throw on the other one. Looking like a proper engine now. Shiny bits and normal bits. Bits that I'll, I'll, all kind of bits. I like them all. <laughs> did we fix the chain? We did not. We need to buy another one. So go to car parts. It's the bring. It's the bring. It's the bring. Bring is the bring over here. There we go. Throw on the new one. What's left? I can't see past this thing. Now I can. Timing chain with sprocket. There. Are you happy now, game? Are you happy with my achievement? What is that? It's fine. It's there. Ooh, is, that, is that everything? I think... I think we may. What is it? Oh, bloody hell. It's one of these again. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know what's missing. I honestly, I can't think. Obviously, I've got the, the idea here. So, oil pan. Uh, right. Well, that's that's quite an important part, Theo. But let you put that on. Oh, I have to assemble it from the bottom, of course. That's why I'm an idiot. I couldn't see it. There we go. And the oil pan <laughs> is fucking dead. Let's put the oil pan in, please. Once again, a straight six. I'm guessing it's a straight six. Obviously, with the the gearbox of a straight four, which sounds fucking stupid, but fucking go for it, Sm smash your gears, melt your gears, mate. Go for it. What what's left? Uh, rubber bushing. Fuck you. Small rubber bushing. Fuck you. Clip B. Rubber bushing. Clip. What? Fuck you and your rubber bushings. Shove them up your ass. Where do you want these rubber bushings to go? Up your ass is not the answer. <laughs> I'm not. I'm not putting a rubber bushing up your butt. Uh, aha, there's the rubber bushing, number one, and I'm guessing I missed the other one on the other side as well. The rubber bushing, I told you, they're a bloody nuisance, they are. They should they should go back to where they came from. Don't come back. <laughs> aha, small rubber bushing in your pop. I don't know what you're freaking tying to, but whatevs, kevs. And that one is already there, which means, I think, if we miss this one this side. No, we are, I think that might be it. Is that it? Where are the clips? Where did the clips go? I've completely... Oh, there. That's it. I've, I've remembered now. Did the clips get fixed? One of the clips got fixed. Are you joking? Can we reach it? Come on. There we go. Clip B. Now the car is done. 100% fixed on the outside. Car value, 46,000. I should hope it's worth a bloody million, mate. Look at that. Pristine. Mwah. Elegance. I love it. It's it's beautiful. Cream interior. You know me, I love my cream interior. Now what we're gonna do is move you to the dyno. There's no oil in the engine. For God's sake, I forgot. Um now. <laughs> hmm. Aha! I found it. There's the little oil plug thing. So if we go to disassemble. There we go, yes. Pour in that oil, it's missing it completely. I don't care, make a mess all over the car. Lubricate the whole engine. Unintentionally. Are you gonna overfill? Are you gonna overfill it? Are you gonna make a bit of a mess? One. There you go. Beautiful. Beautiful. Topped it off completely. So now you can run. Mwah. I love it. Now move to the dino. Yes, here we go. Dino time. That sound. Holy sh all right. If we go and do a test run, we're gonna see what kind of type of power we're getting. We'll get better than stock because we've got some performance parts in there. 315 horsepower. That's quite a lot. That's quite a lot of power from this granddad. All right, go to, sorry, this one, carburetor tuning. I'm an idiot. It's got, we put the carburetors in, Theo, you're fucking stupid. Now this one, we need to try and max it out as best we can. I don't freaking know how to do it. Oh, we got 9%. I saw a 9%. I don't care. That's what we're going with, 9%. That's as best as we can do. Let's see how that multiplies my beautiful end score. 338, I was expecting a bit more, if I'm honest. Honestly, don't know what color to put on this car. It's very difficult to decide. I like this green in a way. Part of me does really like it. Maybe we go Maybe we go with you. Let's see what this looks like. We're just going to waste money now painting the car because I don't care. I, that's not a nice color at all. That's fucking dreadful. Uh, maybe a yellow would look pretty cool, actually. Let's go with a yellow. On the increase the saturation a little bit. Increase it. Let's go. Apply that paint. Show it. I think yellow. We're going with yellow. The yellow looks awesome. So, my friends, all that is left to do now is to swap the tires. Press F2. Can we press F2 on it? 
There we go. Oh, fuck off. For SF2 on it. We got some tires. We'll put some white walls on it. Yes. Yeah, standard tire, white walls, vintage. All right. You see, the problem is I want race tires, but you know what? I don't care. We get fucking white walls. Let's apply those white walls on this. Oh, yes. Look at it. Now it's a pimp rat rod. We got no doors. We don't need no doors. Here we go. We are... What I'm hoping is that it's not going to wheel spin. So far, it doesn't like it's going to, because it's an old granddad car. It doesn't really need to wheel spin. Let's have a look at it on the car. Oh, look at this. You know this thing's going to fall apart. It's, uh, it's not going to fall. It's just frozen. There we go. It's going again. You know this thing would fall apart if you tapped it against the wall. But I don't care. It's a stu- It's beautiful. I love it. I actually, I actually really do. I really do like it. So, that, my friends, will pretty much- Oh! Well, I cocked up my time a little bit. But that, my friends, will do for this video. Thank you so much for watching this. If you did enjoy, please be sure to leave a like. Let me know if you want to see more Car Mechanic Simulator. <laughs> Car Mechanic Simulator. And I, I think, like, the next video we'll do will be, obviously, the next DLC car for this pack. Because they haven't released it yet. But as soon as they do, I'll be sure to cover it. So, anyway, see you guys in the next video. Peace.